hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is gloria if you're a returning subscriber welcome back in today's video i'm going to be reviewing adjuad adjuad i've had this uh, adjuad perfume for a while i've not reviewed it and the reason is because i have been uh, trying it out to be sure what i actually think about this perfume before bringing it on here for you guys adjuad is a perfume by the house of latafa and this is what it looks like um, this is what it looks like has the name adjuad written here and then in arabic um, has the name of the brand latafa the logo of the brand latafa and at the back it has you know you can see it has made in the uae um the expiration date it has the expiration date here and yeah so for the packaging of this perfume i like the packaging of the perfume because of the color of the box it came in and it's very colorful this is it looks like uh, an african print like something africans we africans will wear to a party so yes that is what i like about this um presentation of the box okay so it opens up like this opens up like this this is very beautiful like the packaging i really like it opens up like this and yes and then bring us <laughs> it's hard yeah like this I don't know if i'm excited about this perfume or not and the reason is the reason that is is because there are some cons uh about these perfumes and there are some pros okay so one of the thing i like about this perfume is one the packaging i really like the packaging of the box not the bottle i like the presentation the presentation of the box i actually like and then i like the fact that the cover is wood is actual wood that's one thing i like about it but what i don't like about it is the fact that it does not cover properly it doesn't cover properly it doesn't even it doesn't even try it doesn't even try it's just there uh the cover is just there for fancy is i don't like that okay and one thing i like again about it is this uh design right here I like it it's beautiful like it's really beautiful when you're looking at it you see that it's actually like a beautiful design here with the uh, cover and the design like they just go together they just go well you know together but aside that if you look if you look at the bottle itself this is what it is looking like it's looking so plain it looks so plain and if you see here you see here it just looks so plain apart from this the sides they are just plain and and this looks like is is going to come up soon or come off soon i don't know if it's peculiar to my own bottle or this is how all the bottles is i just wish that more thoughts was put into this design because you know what i have seen perfumes by latafa that don't cost as much as adjuad and they have better presentation so i just felt a little bit disappointed in terms of um how well they presented the bottle okay other than that that's 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 it for for the bottle but for the juice the juice itself <laughs> See, let me tell you something about Adjuad. The first time you spray it, you might not like it. That, that's the truth. When you have this, when you buy this perfume, the first time you try it out, I would say before you buy this perfume, be sure you like it. Try it out before. Don't blind buy Adjuad because you might not you might not like it. There is a probability that a lot of people might not like this scent. Okay, but it's actually a lovely scent. Okay. But a lot of people might not. It's not a scent for um, everybody. Now, when you smell this scent, you 
you will not understand what you're smelling at the first spray at the first sniff you will not understand what you're, you're smelling okay at the notes at, like you, you don't know if you're smelling like a lot of fruits there is so much you know fruits going on uh as soon as you you smell it you're not sure but if you leave it to settle down when you come back for it you see that it begins to smell um like something nice okay but the first sniff will put you off the first sniff will put you off okay now at the top you have fruity notes you have a lot of fruits like a a blast of fruits a blast of um lots of fruits that is what you get at the at the top okay and then at the middle you have floral notes you have jasmine at the, at the at the middle okay you have jasmine now it's settling down is coming up with that sweet sweetness okay and at the base you have vanilla you have musk you have cedar and you have amber so when it settles down you begin to get uh, the mix of the floral the jasmine and the the vanilla not too much of it you know not too much of it but you definitely definitely get the amber the musk you get the musk in this and get the cedar okay all of this just comes together so nicely at the base when you give it time all right this is a 60 ml bottle it's not huge it's not big yes i know it's 60 ml and it's all the perfume concentration and yes see this perfume is marketed as unisex yes it's marketed as unisex now the people that will actually like this perfume or enjoy this perfume um will be ladies you know mature ladies you know all those ladies that always like to show a rich anti vibe that is the people that will like this perfume younger people stay away from this perfume and if you want to buy this perfume test it before you buy it test it before you buy it test it before you buy it the reason i'm saying this is because this is not perfume for everybody this is a perfume for confident people because this perfume actually projects good it projects good and it lasts good okay it projects above average and it lasts above average so for projection i will give this perfume a seven and then for longevity for this i will give it a seven as well for packaging I will give it a seven so for this perfume it's just seven 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 for me and the reason it has taken this long for me to review this perfume is because i was actually really taking my time to really you know understand this perfume because the perfume is actually like a unique um perfume that not everybody would like honestly honestly speaking for me i did not really like it i don't Gravy. i don't use it a lot a lot a lot and the reason i was using it is because i wanted to try it i wanted to you know but after trying it for a while it's not a bad perfume but it's not my kind of scent but it's a lovely scent but it's not just my it's not just my kind of scent okay the scent the people that will like this are people that go to parties a lot okay but that does not mean i still don't use it though i use it when i want to put on that rich anti vibe yes this perfume, this perfume uh is perfume for occasions when you want to go for parties and oh yeah that is when you use this perfume so in all adjured is i will rate it a seven a seven out of ten that is what i will rate it but it's a lovely scent for people who like loud fruity floral musky vanilla everything combined if you like that kind of uh notes in perfumes then i'm sure you would like this but if you're not sure if you're new to the perfume game and you're not sure please try out this perfume before you buy it okay i hope you enjoyed this video that's it for this video if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a like if you have not subscribed to my channel click on the subscribe button and join the family and uh, subscribing is actually free of charge nobody is charging you any money nobody is charging you anything just click it's free of charge and i'll see you in my next video